So in today's dev tip, we're going to talk about the details tag. So this is just a HTML tag that allows you to create an expanding section in your page without using any JavaScript because it is literally just a HTML tag. So let me show you how it works. Um, you literally just put a tag in your page called details, and then you can put some hidden content inside it. So let's just say some hidden content. And what you'll find comes on the page is a, a new element uh, that has a title of details and this little chevron next to it. And if you click anywhere on the details or the chevron, it will reveal that hidden content that we put inside the details tag. So one thing you might want to do is actually uh, put a different bit of text at the top of it rather than details to actually change that summary text. So you can actually do that by putting another tag inside the details tag. And this one is just called summary. And you could put something like click here for more info. And as you can see, it will actually change that text that was on the top of the details tag before. So this is actually just a HTML element, so you can actually change the way it looks with Sim CSS. Um, and you, one thing you'll notice is you can't actually, or it doesn't actually provide you with um, a cursor when you hover over it. So that might be something we could change. So over in our SCSS file here, let's just target all of the details tags on the page and set their cursor to pointer. And of course you can apply any other CSS rules that you like as well. So for example, we could put a border on here and maybe just a bit of padding. And now we've got a nice block of expanding text that opens up when you click that text or the chevron uh, on the uh, details tag. So that's just a quick way to put some hidden content on your page that expands when you click on the text that's been provided. And of course, you can style it however you like with CSS. So that's it for the details tag. Stay tuned for more dev tips.